the, I imagine the result of that will be two very confident teams facing each other because Sunderland have been on their own tremendous run. Yeah, and furthermore, they, as a counter-attacking team, I, I'm sure they're quite happy to be playing away from home at the moment because that suits sometimes the counter-attacking team. So we we have a another game ahead tomorrow, which will, I'm certain, uh, throw up lots of challenges. And uh, if we if we're to win it or to get a result from it, then we're going to have to make certain that we do what we did against Wolves and we we get things right, really, in terms of our play throughout the 90 minutes. And then you've got to hope, finally, that uh, that fickle finger of fate, which hasn't exactly often been on our side at the Hawthorns, is going to suddenly turn and point towards us rather than against us. Yep, there's always been goals, and I think that both teams got goals in them. So, you know, it doesn't, on paper, look like a nil-nil fixture, but then you never know, and uh, who knows? You know, you don't even know... All results that you can envisage beforehand, you don't know whether you're going to be happy with them or unhappy with them. I mean, the the, the, the game itself has to decide that for you. And that's the whole beauty of football, that you know we can speculate and talk about what they can do and what we can do and whether they're in form or whether we're in form. But the bottom line is it, you know, it'll take the 95 minutes tomorrow to find out.